Okay, so this is the mid-size grip of Henry's driver. So this is the one he uses, what I would call his gamer. So you can see that his swing plane at 49 is pretty good. He gets a little bit on the high handle side. That's what he works on to try and get the handle lower. Spin rate's good, launch good. Look, it's a good driver, it should be. It's dialed in, and he's got every reason to have a dialed in driver, by the way. But you can see from dispersion wise, Henry tends to pull it a touch with a slightly sharp face. To be fair, on the golf course, he definitely hits it sort of heel side and fading. So this is an interesting discussion that we're going to have down the road about GC2 quad against Trackman and what it sees and what it doesn't see. But fundamentally, apples for apples, that's his current driver. Now, when we switch to the standard size grip, you'll see a couple of things that jump out at you. So we'll do that in a second. Okay, so we've got the standard driver, uh, standard grip, sorry, driver up. And you can see the clubhead speed's a little higher. So that's that's probably something to do with a thinner grip going faster. But look at his VSP, it's, a, it's almost a degree higher. So that higher handle type of idea is definitely, you know, in there. And you can see dispersionally, is hitting them left and right, so the, the wide is now in play. Uh, and you can see the spin and launch are pretty similar. So the speeds wise, the thinner grip does create a bit more speed, but mechanically for Henry, the grip's a little bit causing that VSP to come up a little bit. Now, you know me, I'm a little bit into that VSP stuff. I don't like a high handle, that causes a lot of flipping. So if you wanna potentially drop your VSP a little lower, then a, a, a mid-size or bigger grip might do that for you, but it depends how much speed you want to lose. But interesting just experiment, but let us know how you feel. But have a bit of fun with it. It's a great product, great driver. I think they've finally got something that's what I would call a ball speed monster.